Hello everybody and welcome back to more Fallout 4. Here is McCready. I'm here to take him along with me instead of Valentine like I originally planned. But uh, he had something to say so I decided to start nice recording. Nice to be on the open road. Good neighbor was starting to wear out its welcome. What makes you say that? Good neighbor was a good place to look for work, but a crappy place to hang your hat. Let's put it this way. Can't get much rest when you're sleeping with one eye open. Still... It was the best place for me to set up shop. Diamond City's goons would have run me out of town, and wandering the Commonwealth alone isn't the brightest plan when you're hard up for caps. Setting up shop? What do you mean? I needed somewhere to hang out so that people could find me when they required my services. The folks in Good Neighbor tended to not ask too many questions, which suited my needs. So, I made a deal with Hancock and started waiting for the caps to roll in. Hmm. Caps aren't worth risking your life. Easy for you to say. Uh, right now, I need every cap I can get. I don't know if that was the right decision for her to say. Like, I don't know. I hope you aren't in trouble. No, not really. But uh, I don't usually go around sharing stuff like this. But you've been pretty straight with me, so I'm going to be straight with you. It's those two asshole, <clears throat> Those two idiots you saw me talking to at the third rail. Winlock and Barnes. Now, they've been hounding me for months, and it's been driving off clients. No one wants to touch me once they learn I used to run with the gunners. And I figured if I could get enough caps together, maybe I could buy them out. Mm-hmm. I wouldn't trust them. I wouldn't trust those guys, even if you paid them off. Yeah, I'm right there with you. Winlock and Barnes have a small army of gunners with them at all times. They might decide to just keep the caps and put a bullet in my head for good measure. If I set up a place to meet them, I'm sure they'd roll in with everyone they've got. Unless, maybe you and I could pay them a little visit and put an end to them before they realize what's going on. Before you get that look on your face, let me just say that I wouldn't even be asking if I didn't trust you. I'll help. If you need my help, I'm there. Wow. I don't know what to say. Truth is, I haven't been able to rely on anyone since I was a kid. Everyone I've met has either tried to rip me off or plant a knife in my back. But you, you're different. We see eye to eye on almost everything. And I have a funny feeling you actually care about what happens to me. That's why I asked for your help. I'll tell you what, I'm gonna make this easy on you. If you feel like helping me with this, head over to the Mass Pike Interchange and we'll take them down. If you don't, I'm not going to hold it against you. Either way, thanks for hearing me out. It's nice to know that you care. It's love. Hey, <laughs> there you are. Just I kidding. I thought you forgot about me. No, I'm here to uh, take you with me. Time to hit the road. I knew you couldn't live without me. All right, McCready. Actually, what I was going to do was um, I was actually going to go back to the police station to talk with Paladin Dance here because well. You guys have gotten back to me about, you know, the whole faction stuff. And, yes, I am going out of character by doing this. I mean, this isn't, uh, this isn't really in line with what I would actually do in this situation because I really don't like the Brotherhood of Steel, so I probably realistically wouldn't help them but alas i am going to go and do this just for the sake of seeing what the game has to offer on the brotherhood of steel side um this is a decision i made more because i am lping it rather than because i am rping it so yeah I just want to see what the game has to offer. Although I'm probably going to be like so annoyed the entire time I'm here with these guys. Hi, Dance. On their heads in power Paladin armor. Dance. There's still a place for you in the Brotherhood. If you want it. I'm not sure that I do, but sure. I'd be honored to join. Not really. And that but... settles it. Halen, Reese. 
It's time to welcome our newest recruit to the Brotherhood. She shows a lot of promise, and with the proper guidance, I think she has the potential of becoming one of there the There better best. not be any, like, hazing. What is... When do I get to head up to the Pridwin? Paladin dance will decide when you're allowed up there. Until then, I'm afraid you're stuck with us. So you decided mm -hmm. to stay, huh? I expected you to take your payment and run. Fuck you. Are you upset that I'm staying? Maybe. Got enough trouble stomping muties and ferals. I don't need something else to worry about. Reese, that's enough. Like it or not, you're going to have to learn to work together. And you... You need to understand what it means to be a part of the Brotherhood. We're not soldiers of fortune. We're an army. And we've dedicated our lives to uphold a strict code of ethics. Ethics of being assholes? Ranks, you out. need to obey our tenets without question. Uh-huh. Are you going to teach me this code of ethics? If you were paying attention in Arcjet, you should have learned some of it already. The rest will become apparent as you spend time with your fellow soldiers. Now... Since I know you're eager to get started, I'll get right to the point. I only ask for two things from anyone under my command. Honesty and respect. You fall in line, you stay in line. I give you an order, and you follow it. It's as simple as that. There's one last order of business I wanted to get out of the way. I'm going to recommend you to be awarded the rank of knight. Whoa, what? Now, nothing's official until Already? you speak to Elder Maxon. But I wanted you to be the Why? first to know. What? Does this mean I'm one of you now? As far as I'm concerned, yes. Ad Victorium, Knight. She doesn't even know what that means, Halen. Ad Victorium means to victory. Wait, In what rank eyes, is Knight, anyways? Is, is that like. Because we're fighting for know. the future of mankind. Our rallying cry. Now, Oops, I've received I orders that we're both to arrow. report to the Pridwin. Oops. However, if you want to run a few ops for Scribe Halen or Knight Reese first, they could certainly use your assistance. I'll leave the choice up to you. Let me know when you're ready to mount up. Yeah, uh... For all I know, knight means private negative first class. Uh, okay, so... <laughs> yeah, uh... This is gonna be great. Support the Brotherhood Recon Team, okay. What was the other one that I had that said report to Paladin Dance? The Shadow of Steel. Can I? Paladin. Are you ready to head up to the ship? Oh, no, not yet. Not yet. Understood. Let me know when you're ready to depart. Uh, I was kind of wanting to talk to you about the other thing, but okay, just stomp around. Scribe Halen. Re still giving you the cold shoulder. I can handle it. If you could, you'd be the first. Reese bleeds brotherhood. <laughs> it's all he lot cares of about. It's his family. It's his whole life. If anything else comes into the picture and gets in the way, he shoves it aside. Is there something between the two of you? When I first joined up, <laughs> Reese is the one who sponsored me. He took me under his wing, showed me the ropes. I thought there was a little more between us, so I asked him if he cared about me that way. He told me the Brotherhood of Steel was all that he cared about, and there was no room for anything else in his life. We never spoke about it again. Look, I... Damn. I need to get back to things. If you're worried about Reese, just keep doing what you're doing. He'll come around soon enough. So, are you ready to take on your first assignment? Last Christmas, Halen gave him his or her heart, and apparently he threw it away. What exactly does a scribe do for the Brotherhood? We do everything that the pilots and the soldiers need to keep all of their operations running. All the scientific research, the repairs, the tactical planning, you name it. <laughs> we do all of the technical the brains. work. Of course, the I'm a field scribe, so I'm boots on the ground with the soldiers, but I kind of like pulling the trigger every once in a while. Oh, anyway, I won't bore you with any more of the details. You ready to head out on your assignment? Uh, wait, hold on. No, I I need more time. That's uh, all right. I'll talk to Reese first. I understand. Grab whatever you need and check back with me when you're ready. He's probably gonna spout some crap at me. <clears throat> all right, out with it. What's your game? 
Game? What do you mean? I can usually size people up at a glance, but you... You're different. And it's bugging the heck out of me. I'm 200 years you're old, military type. Sonny. You're a loner. So I can't figure out why you're sticking around. You got what you wanted, so why don't you hit the road? The Brotherhood might be the best chance I'll ever have to find my son. Well, as far as reasons go, that's a pretty good one. Look, I'm gonna cut you some slack because Dance trusts you. But if you step out of line and put any of my brothers or sisters in danger, I'll make sure you regret it. So, ready for your assignment, hero? What's your problem? My problem is I can't figure you out. You come from out of the blue. Take down a few ferals, and suddenly you're all buddy-buddy with Paladin Dance. I don't know if you're serious about being a part of the Brotherhood, or you're just biding your time until you find whatever it is you're looking for. It's the latter. Either way, until just you take a few now. of these assignments under your belt, I'm gonna be keeping my eye on you. Now, you ready to go or what? All right, let's get this over with. Ready. Then listen up. Like it or not, one of our most important duties is to keep the Commonwealth clear of the trash. I'm talking about mutants. That's ghouls, a lot of trash. Synths. The abominations the damn eggheads caused when they started playing with their toys. Kinda need a bigger landfill. This land is simple. I'm gonna and send a you to a truck. target, and you're gonna terminate everything that calls it home. All the details you need are right here. Don't come back until the job's done. Dude, I am good at this shit. This is what I do in my spare time. Halen? Good. You're back. Are you ready to take on your first assignment? I think it would be my second because he's still, like talking to me ready. about the Great. other thing, but you know. Let me explain what I need you to do. One of the Brotherhood's most important duties is the recovery and preservation of technology that was lost when the bombs fell. I have a list of locations that contain artifacts we need you to recover in order to have them cataloged and studied by our scribes. Here, this should cover all the information you'll need to find your first artifact. Good luck and be careful. Awesome. Recovered a reflex capacitator. Let's sleep for an hour just to top ourselves off. Locating the artifact can be just mm -hmm, as mm -hmm. Okay. So where exactly is this? Wait, which one are we gonna do? Hold on. We still got Semper and Victor on. I should probably just turn that off. And yeah, let's do this first. Vault 95. A vault. Mmm. That's exciting. Oh, it's down here. In the glowing sea. I just ditched Valentine. Ah. Okay, um... I mean, it's not that far in the glowing sea, but... I really don't want to take my power armor. I still have my hazmat suit. I can wear my hazmat suit. I don't know why, I just really don't like power armor. It. I hate the way it feel, feels. What am I going to do about McCready, though? How do I get McCready to go put on power armor? I guess I'll just, uh... I guess you can, like, order them to do that? Alright, let me go fetch my power armor for McCready. Okay, yeah, I can just, like, tell him to get the hell in. Get There's no way to get there. Alright. Pardon me? Alright. Oh, my god. Sometimes this game, man, get in. Okay, thank you. Actually, I don't even know if that thing... Yeah, it's like half broken and shit, but you know what? That's okay. How do I... Okay, tab out. Alright, and... As for myself, I'm going to... Oops. I'm going to put on... Oh my god, I don't even... Okay, hold on. Okay, now I'm in my hazmat suit. Um, I went to my armor workbench just to rename all my shit so that I can find it easier afterwards because not being able to find it would be really annoying. Uh, okay. Yeah, let's go to the freaking glowing sea. 
I mean, hopefully I don't have to stay in this suit for that long, because uh, maybe the inside won't be so badly irradiated. I don't know. I'm hoping, but not very, <laughs> not very high hopes. Okay. That way. Okay, so we do get affected by some radiation still. But it's less than one, so we can deal with it. It's fine. Yo, Crady. Where you at? <laughs> Not interested in following me, apparently. Oh, no radiation over here. Maybe it was just extra bad because of this uh, lightning bolt there? Yeah, looks like it. It is crazy. I know this isn't the way I'm supposed to be going, but this just interested me all of a sudden. I don't know, I just wanted to look on top of it. Cause there's like, a light over there. And I want to see what's... Oh, what? What are you doing here? Like, how? Where, where'd you go? I did, uh, off camera, I did go and um, make some of my armor a bit better and made some improvements to some of my guns, so... Yeah, they do slightly better, like, damage and, um... Better recoil, shit like that. Oh, come on. Can do it. Oh no, I was so close. Okay, seriously? Come on. Sweet. Thank you. Yes. Love it when it's in the default position. Combat rifle. Hmm, how nice. Well, I don't know how the hell you are living out here, man, but, uh... Jeez. Ain't in the living world anymore, so... I wonder what he does for fusion cores. Yeah, um... Wait, what? Why are there gunners here? I have no idea where you actually are. There you are. mutating poop. Uh, what are you doing? Is that a mannequin? That is a mannequin. Oh my god. Where? Well, I guess it's kind of fitting. Brought McCready and we're dealing with gunners. What the fuck? is going on. Like, I don't even know where you guys are. I don't know where McCready is. Oh. What the shit is this? Okay. Uh, no thank you. Please, please remove yourself from my presence. I do not appreciate this. Ow! 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 It kind of feels that way, not gonna lie! 
Dude, Gunners, I don't have time for you right now. I've been on the Saltron on my freaking ass. <sighs> Please die. Oh, God. And yes, I did put a mod on the gun that gives it fire damage. Oh, God. Oh, God. You guys are freaking horrendous. Horrifying. Where's the... Where's the goddamn turret? Oh, Jesus. We're splitting all that, right? Yeah, sure. My God. Okay. Where was Miss Legendary Lady? I thought she died here. Oh, there's her gun. Oh, there's her- <laughs> Her body was like- Pretty much blending in with the ground in my eyes. Movement speed by 10%. Wow. Very nice. Uh... Well, now that we're here and it's not- Irradiated. I kind of feel like, eh. Silly. Silly, silly for fetching all my radiation crap. Oh, this probably didn't help with fighting these guys. Probably took a lot more damage than I usually would have. Okay. Sort by name. Okay. Oh, what a nice elevator. Hi, Critty. Actually, if you look behind, it, it doesn't have a vision core. In there. So, do I need to like? Hold on. Hey. What's up? Yeah, do I need sure. to like I'll manually give him trading cores? Oh my god. He's like, no, you do have fusion cells. Huh. Okay. But yeah, your shit's like all busted. I'm sorry. I probably should have fixed that before giving it to you, but. Because I don't really care. Oh, it's on this side. Oh, even his stomping around behind me is just gonna Bats. be annoying. I'm pressing E. Thank you. Oh, turret control. I mean, if we can turn them off. No guns shooting at me is always welcome. Is that something under there? No, just a box. What wow. the? Oh, huh? you guys are in here too. Now we're just starting to have fun. There's more fun available. Oh god, uh, Mr. Gutsy. To take care of that right away. Before it comes in like freaking Oh my god. More automatron or assaultron, sorry. Okay. Oh, I guess I forgot my hat. <laughs> Please don't. Ow. 
But yes, I definitely took less damage from that than before, and... Oh, jeez. Such awesome frame rate. Where are you? This thing has some really good accuracy. I think it's got like 250... over 250. Which is pretty nice. It's better than my freaking sniper rifle. God, I hope there's a bounty on you. Ah, uh, I'm sure there is. If you find the appropriate people, I'm sure they will pay you marvelously for my head. I mean, if you knew the appropriate information. Is it just like crawling with these guys, isn't it? I mean, I'm just trying to look at what you guys have because I believe that carrying is sharing. I don't know if I wanna. You know, I saw those, then I just like decided to walk forward anyways. I don't know why. Okay, this keeps going down. I don't really want to go down. Not right now, anyways. I mean, I will eventually. Are you just... Is that another mannequin? I keep getting freaked out by mannequins. Please stop. Stop with the freaking mannequins. I freaking hate mannequins. Freak me the hell out. Who's throwing shit? Where are you? Hey, assholes. There you are. Get out again. I dare you. <laughs> Wasting time. Come on, McCready. <laughs> Don't tell me you're not having the time of your life here. A microscope. That reminds you of the old days. Need me one of those. Oh man, there's like so many places to go. I just feel like I'm gonna miss everything by going one way or the other. I suppose I will have to backtrack and all that. This is not a working terminal. I'm too lazy to go in my inventory, so... Oh! What happened here? You guys have clean cups. That's some consolation, right? And a very dirty window. Shame on you. Alright, Vault 95 Overseer Manifest. The Overseer of Vault 95 is an elected individual chosen to run the daily meetings and ensure the other residents adhere to the rules of the Vault Tech Rehabilitation Program. This is not to be considered a position of power, but rather a position of support and servitude. Infractions are to be dealt with using positive reinforcement and encouragement. The residents of Vault 95 are family and share the same path. The position of Overseer should not prevent a resident from continuing their own personal journey. An election will be held once a year on October 3rd. Residents are encouraged to inform their decisions or inform their decision based on awarded merit points as laid out in the program guidelines. Meeting notes. Okay, overseer slash facilitator Jane Myers. The usefulness of continued meetings. <laughs> Resident Michael has expressed his desire to reduce the amount of meetings. He believes chem dependence is no longer an issue. Resident Randall reminds, reminded the group that adherence to the program was a condition of living in the vault. Resident Patricia wondered if Velt Tech even existed anymore. Resident Randall reminded the group that we are all addicts. 
We may pick up unhealthy habits without the program. I expressed agreement with Randall's sentiments. Issue was put to vote. Vote to continue the program was unanimous. Unlock facilities wing. Okay. That's helpful. I haven't yet encountered said wing, but helpful. For when I get there. Nice of you guys to create bullets in here. Okay. Well, let's go find that locked door, shall we? But we shall continue this next time. So I'll see you guys then.